Right, Daniel. Well, that uh, that will be coming later on. But first, let's begin with the fun and the perks of the World Economic Forum. So, if you're here in Davos and you're just attending the sessions and meetings from eight to six, you're missing out a lot. That's because in the evening and night, Davos turns very different. And among those are cultural nights or national nights, where countries get to offer their traditional food, and music. Pop culture, and、um, as well as a lot of networking going on in those nights. Last night was Korean night, among others, and our Kim Minji was there. Hundreds of people were able to experience a bit of Korean culture at the Korean night event. Organized by the Federation of Korean Industries, the event was attended by prominent figures, with the guest list including Special Presidential Envoy and Korea's former finance chief Choi Kyung-hwan, SK Group Chairman Choi Tae-won, as well as the CEO of Arirang TV, Pang Seok-ho. Under the theme K Culture, connect to the world. Attendees are able to network as they enjoy the finest Korean food and music. In a video message, President Park Geun-hye said Korea is marrying its culture with creative ideas to further lift the economy and society, and is stepping up its role in connecting the world. The power of culture to bring healing is advancing the cause of human happiness. At a time when borders are eroding, when our world is increasingly becoming a shared community. I look forward to humanity being brought together and connecting through culture. On the sidelines of the World Economic Forum, the event aims to boost Korea's presence on the global stage and further promote Korea's brand value. Through Korea Night, foreigners can learn about the country and mingle. I think it's a great opportunity to promote Korea. It's the eighth year now, and I believe it's been beneficial to boosting Korea's image. And attendees seem to agree. The interest in Korea is quite high.、Uh, Davos is an environment where people are always interested in exploring markets, understanding what's happening in them. And I think because there are so many Korean executives in Davos, there are therefore a lot of international business people who want to be at Korea now. And that's why it's even busier than it was last year. Kim Minji, Arirang News, Davos.